Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Dennis Casey, but you can just call me Dennis. And if you're watching this, it's because I'm your tutor for critical skills. I've made this video to introduce myself and to give you a feeling for what our classes will be like this semester. Firstly, a little bit about myself. My background is in medieval history and literature, and this is my fifth year of teaching critical skills. I'm currently undertaking a postgraduate diploma in higher education here in Maynooth in order to enhance my teaching and yours and my classroom experience. Now, while I am trying to improve my teaching, ultimately, I can't make you learn. I can offer advice, encouragement, feedback, all those necessary things, but learning is something that you do in here. My aim, in many respects, is to enable you to be an independent learner. Learning is something that happens in a wide variety of ways and environments, and importantly, it often happens in social environments. Students often learn as much from each other as they do from their instructors. For that reason, I'll try to facilitate you working together as much as possible. Sometimes it might be something as simple as a think, pair, share exercise, where I pose a question to you, then ask you to think on it individually, then discuss your thoughts in pairs, and finally share that with the class. And that way we build our knowledge and understanding together. Learning and development also occurs outside the classroom, the library or the lab. And I'm a strong advocate for students to develop themselves as people and not just as learners during their time in university. For that reason, I'm a mentor with the National Goshka program, and I encourage you to become involved in your students union and the wide range of clubs and societies within Maynooth. If you want to know more, feel free to drop me a line anytime. Lastly, I appreciate that these first few weeks will be a bewildering time for you. Indeed, we're all students and staff trying to adjust to a new working environment, so we all need to be a little bit patient with each other and with ourselves. In your first weeks, it'll probably be a bit confusing with timetable issues, trying to find rooms, make subject choices, and of course, with the added responsibility of adhering to public health guidelines. Now, I can assure you that these concerns have been faced by hundreds of students I have had in critical skills over the years. And just as they overcame them, with a little perseverance, so will you. If you feel you're struggling, like I said, drop me an email. You're not bothering me by doing so, and it's always better to say something to somebody rather than to stay silent. I might not always have an immediate answer, but I may be able to direct you to one of the support services within the university who can help. So I'll end simply by saying, I look forward to seeing you in class.